Hi, I'm Robert Owen, Chief Architect of Hybrid IT Solutions for CDI. Thanks for taking your time to meet with us today. We're going to talk a little bit about the hyperconverged space and try to make some sense of the hyperconfusion that exists in the marketplace today. As I'm sure you've all seen in the last six months, we've seen a lot of players enter this market space that was pretty locked down by two significant players before that, which we believe gives a true validation to the marketplace. So what is hyperconverged and why should you care about it? Hyperconverged infrastructure is the data center architecture that embraces cloud principles and economics. So what that means is we're going to bring simplicity, agility, and efficiency into the data center without creating a lot of complexity. In order to be a hyperconverged system, you need to be based on software, okay? And we're going to talk a little bit about three acts in this solution or solutions that really will define the future of what hyperconverged means. So as we consolidate things like compute, storage, network, hypervisor, and data protection, it really becomes important that we're able to bring enterprise functionality on x86 commodity building blocks. So as this market is validated, hardware decisions will definitely impact software choices, right? So the hardware or why hardware matters to the success of your software-defined storage deployment is based on whether you choose one of two things, right? We can either go down the road of a pre-integrated appliance or a hardware neutral offering based on reference architecture. So we'll see that kind of evolve as we go through this when we talk about either consuming hardware or consuming software that you can choose your own hardware on, right? And that becomes important to the level of integration and almost the level of science project that you're gonna create for yourself. So with rapid deployment comes predictable results. We've seen this evolve through three distinct phases in, in, in our market. And the first one is the traditional one that we're all used to, right? Where we go out and we choose storage, we choose servers, we choose networking, we choose all the software to wrap around it, we architect, plan, procure, set up, provision, test, and deploy that. And in a best case scenario, that takes three months from the time we decide what we actually want to do to the time that we're deploying production workloads on that system. So time is lost, right? We lose time in architecture, testing, deployment phases, and there's multiple vendors generally associated with this. So we have multiple vendor support to deal with in a, in a production system. As we shift into this, the second set of solutions, which have been very popular over the last few years, you know, call it four or five years now, uh, the converged marketplace, where we have pre-tested and designed solutions that come from the factory ready to roll, ready to deploy. Um, once, once they kind of hit the loading dock, you're able to deploy VMs within a few days. We've seen a bunch of these steps kind of removed, which reduces the time from three months down to 45 days. So you have faster deployment, Typically, you have single line of support, right? And you have less silos of management. This created a lot of challenges in the enterprise space because they were all designed from a support perspective for the traditional model. So you had server engineers who only worked on servers, networking engineers who only worked on network, storage guys who only knew storage, and that really doesn't work in the converged space. When you get in the converged space, the Converged system becomes an appliance, or should become an appliance. Uh, uh, this is the beginning of the private cloud, right? Now, the, in the newest phase, or third phase, or third act of this hardware deployment, we see hyperconverged, which is based around software definition, okay? Making things invisible, like storage, to the end user, or not even to the end user, to the support personnel. So, what we see is even less steps that are required in deploying the solution and a much faster time to market. So we get back to that cloud-like deployments with really good economics. Thanks again for listening. I'm Robert Owen, Chief Architect of Hybrid IT Solutions for CDI. As you make this journey into the hyper-converged market, please reach out. We'd love to talk to you more about this ever-changing landscape.